helps. Horrifying. <clears throat> Very often you hear this. Students will come to you and ask you, Sir, what about my project? My project, see that is where the importance of stress comes in. What the student wants, wants to say is not project, but project. Understand that? I have just collected 10 words here, same spelling, but different pronunciation. And how one pronunciation is that of the verb of that word, and the other pronunciation is that of the noun. Or sometimes an adjective and a noun, you'll find. So here you are, uh, you'll see this first preference is given to project. <laughs> you can see this. See, when we say project, that is verb. You cannot go to a teacher and say, Sir, what about my project? <laughs> you cannot, because you are asking the teacher to project something. But actually what you want is your project. Project. So project is noun. Project is verb. Same here also you will find. Another word, very often mispronounced this, this. Mispronounced because of the stress. The stress is not given at the right place. Person will see, object. That is verb. Object. We will say object. That is noun. This is an object. This is not an object. So, you can object to somebody's proposal, but you cannot object to that somebody's proposal. The proposal is an object, you can see. And the third one, you see. So, when you say object, that is verb. Object is noun. See, when you change the stress, what happens? Importance of stress again. Another example is convert. Convert. So convert is to change somebody. Isn't it? Uh, he has been converted, converted from X religion to Y religion. You can say converted. That is verb. He is a convert. That means a person who is converted. So the nouns. It, uh, the stress is given to the first part, usually. In this case, you can see, for verbs, it is the second part. Same with the fourth one. You see, insert is verb. Insert. He insulted me. But insult is noun. I will not pardon your insult. You understand that? Insult. Fifth one, increase. Verb. Increase. Noun. Increase. You cannot increase the height of a person. A mature person, fully grown adult, you cannot increase his height. You cannot increase. There is an there is an increase in the prices market. So one is in, increase. Well, there is an increase in gold prices. There is an increase. Today it's about eight hundred rupees per sovereign, eight grams. There is an increase. And next we have got a convict, to convict somebody, to say that he has done something wrong. Convict means he's a convict, means 
he is a he has done something wrong. He is a person who has done something wrong. The other is convict. The judge convicted a person. And therefore he has become a convict. One is verb, the other is noun. Next one we can see contract and uh, the noun is contract, contract, listen, contract, you get into a, a, an agreement, make an agreement, contract, contract means that agreement, what you have made. And the next thing we can see, refuse, refuse, to refuse somebody, say that, no, I won't give you. You came to me to borrow books, I refused. I refused. I won't give my books. <laughs> I will give, don't worry. The other is, refuse. That means, waste. Refuse. And the next one is contrast. And uh, the noun is contrast. Contrast. Contrast is the act of comparing to show difference. Contrast. Listen. I contrast my last year's mark list with this year's mark list. Means I compare to find the difference. There is a contrast between myself and my friends. There is a visible contrast. Contrast. That means difference. Then you have what? Content, adjective. Content. He is content with what he has. And the other is content. What is inside the book? The content of the book. Same spelling. See, but when you change the uh, stress, words will become, adjective will become noun. Verbs will become no, uh, nouns, nouns will become verbs and so on. So how important it is. So I have been telling you, when you, when you are learning a word, spelling, pronunciation, stress, meaning, use in sentence. Okay, then you will be all right. You understand that? So don't go to the your teacher or your professor and sir, sir, what about my project? It's not project, it is project. What do you think about this object? No. Object. Is that clear to you? Bye.